is Claudia from Harmate.es and in today's video I want to teach you how you can change the colors using hue saturation in Photoshop but only to individual layers and keep it editable so you can change it as much as you want. This came from a conversation with Tina yesterday and I think it can be really helpful for everybody so here it goes. What I usually do is I edit the hue and saturation from here, from the layers panel. So if you cannot see it, you should go to window layers and it will pop up this. So if you go down here and you select hue saturation, you can edit it through here. And as you can see, it changes the color of everything, right? And although this layer, it, it's editable and you can change it as much as you want and you can even work on the layer mask, it's much easier if you or much comfortable if you change it individually to each one of the colors so that you can really get the result you want. So all you have to do is you need to come, you need to add this hue saturation on top of the layer you want it to apply. So let's try it with this one and you need to come in between and press Alt on your keyboard. Then it will appear this icon and when you click, this will only apply to this layer. This layer is the lightest one. So as you can see now it's this bluish tone, but if we don't have the hue and saturation, it's more um, of a yellow, greeny color. So this it's how you can change individually and obviously it's gonna work better if you have each color um, together in a layer like I do here but you can do it in individual layers too so then we could come here apply again the hue saturation press alt in between layers now it's only applying here and we can change the tone of this darker tone and we can even make it lighter so you can edit it as much as you want and then I'm gonna teach you another trick if you go to hue saturation here click again you know when you edit by default it's applying to all colors but if you come here you can select which tones you want to edit in this case it's plain colors and it's not gonna make much of a difference but if you have shades if you paint with watercolors like i do it's very interesting sometimes you want to edit only the cyans so you would select cyan and then only move the hue on that color so in this case i'm going to leave it to the master and we can edit this color too so this is it this is how you can change the colors in individual layers i hope you find it useful Please subscribe and give it a like if you liked it and let me know in the comments if this was something new for you, if you learned a new technique, if you have any questions, I'm always happy to chat with you, so I'll be around.